When you're shooting events, especially weddings, it's so important to be prepared. Not just to have the time and the itinerary, but also to be prepared for any worst case scenarios because guess what? Things will go wrong. Uh, okay, good question. Let's do serious one and then smiling right after. How serious? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Here we have the amazing Dimitri Marquine photography. Oh yeah. Good vlog content, I love it. I love it. We take almost to be here for 10.30. Really? But the ride is not even done. So, uh, things are running a little bit late. My bride hasn't got back from the salon yet. Uh, she was supposed to get back about 35 minutes ago. And she's not here yet. And the groom and the groomsmen are here for the next part of the day. And she's not even like here. So, the good thing about this is that Whoa, are you okay? I can't. All right. Um, so the good thing about it is that at least when she gets back from the salon, she'll have her hair and makeup done. But, you know, dress is going to be rushed and everything is going to be a little bit late. So at least, you know, we have the itinerary. We can work it, work in some changes and go from there. Did any sign of the bride? So yeah, we are on our way to the photo session now. Um, what can I say? We started everything over an hour late at the bride's place. Yay! Uh, yay! <laughs> but you know, we got some finger food out of it. And you know, everybody's on their way now. The bride's in a good mood, the groom's in a good mood, so that's great. We are not super late for the pictures. Uh, we are late, so we, we're, we're going to try to crank it out. Um, but at least there was some buffer time, and that's good because originally the schedule was a little bit later, and the event planner moved the time up by an hour, and I'm glad she did because here we are, right? So anyways, come along. We're going to do some pictures with the bride and groom. This area is for Court Ride Center. Enter at... That's the address I put in. A little note about preparation don't just prepare <laughs> yeah I uh, whenever we have weddings now I always make sure I bring snacks I make sure I bring water and Gatorade I make sure I bring Advil um, gum yeah gum's good, um, gum's good. that dragon breath you know I make sure I bring cash in case we walk by a hot dog stand or something <laughs> oh yeah baby spicy Italian baby Um, yeah, and I make sure that I get at least six hours of sleep. <laughs> <laughs> wow, six hours? You, you you upgraded now. Yeah. Usually, like, she doesn't get any sleep, and I'm like, Andrea, did you sleep? And she's like, no, I didn't sleep. Yeah. So that's that's good, Andrea. Yeah. Uh, yeah, so that's it. That's all I have to say. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> So we lost them. We're walking around in the bush, like Blair Witch Project, trying to find them.
Alright guys, everyone look at the camera. Okay, so we're here at the venue and we usually get to the venue a little bit early so we can do some setup and uh, really kind of get a feel of the place before we start. So we set up lights, set up uh, cameras, you know, do color and stuff and uh, make sure we're ready so that when the ceremony or the reception starts, we're, we're good to go. So here we go. So at this particular wedding, uh, they're gonna flip the room, so it's gonna look totally different from what it did in the ceremony. And everything moves around, so when once they finish moving around, we have to go in and move all our stuff too, and make sure that all the positions are right. Uh, then we go in and set up lights, cameras, and sound too, and then we make sure everything is ready for the reception. Yo, we were not ready for that entrance. Like they said that these guys party a lot and it's gonna be pretty crazy in there, but we were not ready. Like everybody just came in and they were running in and the people in the crowd got up and started joining them on the dance floor and it was just this huge mob and, and like we couldn't even find a couple. And so, you know, I got some FaceTime with other people, but at some point I was like, I just need to just go into that big mob and find the couple because we need a shot of them and so yeah you just you know you can prepare but there's just uh, some things that just you just gotta like you just gotta run with it um trust your instincts and uh, yeah just use your discretion in the moment So guys, thank you so much for riding along with uh, me and Andrea today. Um, hope you enjoyed it. If you liked it, give it a like. If you love this content, subscribe. Uh, maybe send it to a friend who's interested in this kind of stuff. And uh, yeah, we're gonna go finish off this wedding and uh, we'll see you in the next one. Peace out.